After seeing this park, you're gonna think that uh, parks in the U.S. are ghetto. Check this out. Ahí está, bien, mira. Bien, ¿no quieres este? Baja los pies. Baja los pies. Tienes que bajar los pies cuando estés abajo. ¿Te dolió? Face first. Yeah. Yeah. Superman! <laughs> she said one more time, like three times already. Yeah, this is working out. She's ready. They're ready with everything. <laughs> oh, that's violence. Can we call the police? 
Domestic violence. Me pegó en la cara, mamá. Adentro, sí. te quieres meter, está frío. No quiero que tienen agua, son separados. Ría, ¿dónde vamos? A Jaroque. Yeah, karaoke time, yeah. Sí. Alright guys, this might be our last stop for the day. We are at the uh, Okuru something yama. <laughs> Okuyama uh, jump ski. Like I think they used it for the Olympics. It's pretty impressive. Hey guys, uh, I'm laying down already. It's about 7.30. I don't want to go to sleep this early because I want to get rid of this uh, jet lag, but I'm kind of tired. Driving went pretty good. Uh, it's just the turns, it kind of got me nervous. 
but on the straightaways I was uh, doing all right. Uh, the definitely the yellow lights are way faster here in uh, Japan. So as soon as the uh, green turns into yellow, you get about two seconds, three seconds before it turns red. And so that got me in trouble twice. And the first time I almost got stuck and I was able to reverse, but on the second one, I got stuck right in the middle because it had a middle divider and I couldn't back up enough. Tomorrow, I'm gonna take her and uh, Lisa. It's supposed to be raining tomorrow, but if it's not raining or if we can kind of put some jackets on, then I'm gonna put uh, V and Lisa on the bike and just go around the block for a little bit. It's not 100% yet, but uh, tomorrow after the bike ride, I might go to the pool, which is nearby. It's an uh, indoor pool, so it should be okay even if it's raining. And then later on for either late lunch or dinner, we're gonna do eat some Genghis Khan, which is kind of like Yakiniko, but it's unique to Hokkaido. Last time uh, we had to take the train because uh, their grandpa was um, was the only driver and you know he didn't want to drink and drive so they're really strict about drinking and driving over here you're allowed zero on the alcohol test anything other than zero and it's like two to five years in jail it's crazy including the passengers if the passengers knew that they were drinking that the driver was drinking they get in trouble too so uh, hopefully we can do that tomorrow thank you for watching guys remember i'm on a mission to retire early and travel the world with my family so on top of my weekly vlogs, I'm also going to put videos on how I plan to generate money on the road, how I save money, how I become a minimalist, and anything that helps me reach that goal of early retirement. Uh, if that's something that interests you, please subscribe to this channel. Click right here to see the latest upload. Click here to see videos that relate to this video right here. Don't forget to hit the little bell so you can get notifications for whenever I upload new videos. And also, if you like this video, please hit the like button. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.